Mel B. The show has baseball on tap from Lovely City Field in Flushing, Queens. Tonight, the opener of a three game series between the Baltimore Orioles and the New York Mets. Alongside Dan Fleezak and Mark DeRosa and Danny, as pitching matchups go, it doesn't get much better than what we've got here for this one. Well, Matt, these are two of the best in the business, two guys that throw a lot of strikes, and if their game is on, we should have a very low-scoring ball game with these two elite starting pitchers. Baltimore hope to put a lid on their seven-game losing streak. Coming up next. He's out. So stepping in is Gerald Payton. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The third baseman, Gerald Payton. Now here's the pitch. Fouled off. Stay hot up there, huh? The wind up and the 0 1. Hit pretty well out toward right center field. Right fielder looking up, still ranging back. Walk off salami. Have a bite of walk off salami sandwich. Santa Maria. So it's a solo home run to lead off the bottom of the first. Number 17 for him on the season, and the Mets are on the board first, 1 to nothing. Baseball has really changed. Remember when leadoff guys were guys who would just draw walks and steal bases? But that's not the case anymore. Guys like this, they have pop on their bat and they can go deep. Now to bat, Cedric Mullins. Try to bunt for a base hit here as he gets this one down. And he'll beat the throw as he's got himself a bunt single. Now to the plate, Gerald King. And we'll see what he can do here after going deep his first time up. He turned around that fastball and drove it out of the park in his previous at bat. So there's got to be a good chance they mix it up right here on him and try and go off speed. Hammered the other way to deep right field. And that'll get down out there near the wall. Around second. He's on his way to get third. Get dirty, get dirty, get dirty. Relay throw. Well, he is in there with a triple. Yeah, and most guys that hit for the cycle can get a single or a double but struggle with the rest. Not this guy. He's already got the homer and the triple, so the hardest parts are out of the way. We'll see what the rest of the game holds in store. Austin Hayes the next okay, to bat. Okay. He's 0 for 1 after no grounding field, out in his only trip oh, to the plate so far. Yeah, and I know you want to lace a line driver, hit a potential home run. But I'll tell you what, grab the cheap ribby when it's there. Give me a ground ball middle of the diamond and steal a run. Doms is there. Let's see if they try it. And add a run on the sacrifice fly as that will make this a 3-1 to game. Great job of offensive execution there. Lead off triple and then the sack fly to bring home a run. So the lineup flips over and digging in Gerald Hayden as the switch hitter will bat right handed here. Even though he's batting right handed in this particular bat this guy swings it from both sides of the plate. Numbers pretty much the same across the board. A terrific hitter right handed in this at bat. But if you try to switch this guy around from the left side he can do some damage also. Gets the fastball by him here and he's in control 0 and 2. And it's fouled away. Let it fly. Let it fly right here. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. Up with it, Rutschman. And the throw is made to record the second out of the inning. So next to bat will be Gerald Hayden. He's got a homer and a triple to this point in the game. Ready 
Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hit high and deep is straight away right field. Racing back the right fielder. Walk off salami. Have a bite of walk off salami sandwich. Santa Maria. A two run blast to straight away right field is second of the game and it's now a six to one ball game. Well, he's as hot as anybody in the game right now, hitting a homer yesterday and two more today. They need to rethink whatever strategy they're using to pitch to him because he's killing them. So now here is Ramon Urias. Uh, 2 2. Drops one down here and he'll try to beat it out. And he'll just put it in his pocket. It's an infield single. Always nice to get the first game of the series, but even more so when it's in front of the home crowd. Seems to energize everybody the rest of the series. And tonight's comes to a conclusion. Six to one the final. The Mets get their division leading 30th win of the year. Marcus Stroman earns his fifth winner of the year. So that will wrap things up.